Hey, what's up? In this video, I'll be placing this wire array in the uh, vacuum chamber and uh, sending 7,000 volts through it to see what would happen. So obviously, I'm not going to just place this thing in a vacuum chamber and set it off because I don't want to have my vacuum chamber explode or have any of these metal strap metal flying into my vacuum pump and destroying that. So I'm going to do a step-by-step -step process and uh, slowly build my way up into actually placing this in a vacuum pump. Three, two, one. And looking at the high speed, I can see that this thing has a lot of power and I do not want to have that thing because I'll pretty much have a pipe bomb on my hands or uh, something that would destroy my vacuum pump. So I'm starting with just a single wire and uh, from that you can just see that it just pretty much vaporizes and coats the inside of it. And going in the slow motion, you could see that it turns into a small little plasma, but it's a little blip, nothing else. All right, so the coil is now on the tube and uh, it's in atmospheric pressure. All right, ready? Three, two, one. And the power this thing has was enough to blow off both ends. So there everything turned green, you can see the oxidized copper and uh, my vacuum pump, everything was connected, didn't damage it, um, all the force pretty much went outwards instead of into the hose. So here's the setup. I'm using copper wool as a baffle inside the tube to slow down the pressure as it goes into the secondary chamber and I'm using more copper wool inside that chamber to slow down any fragments going inside so it doesn't get sucked up into my vacuum pump. All right, ready? Three, two, one. And then going to the slow-mo. And there it goes. Nice little ball of plasma. And a really, really bright light bulb. I think I put one megawatt of power. It was pretty bright too. Even though I was outside the room and the door was closed, like you can see the light just bleeding out of there. And the after effects, you can actually see that the inside is completely coated in black. Um, the bathroom did his job and stopped all that pressure from going into the secondary chamber, which was good and nowhere near my vacuum pump. So you can see the difference between the one in atmosphere and the one in vacuum. 